So the soldiers took charge of Jesus. There we go. Uh, right, right, right. He had to carry his own cross. He went out to a place called the Skull. In the Aramaic language, it was called Golgotha. There they nailed Jesus to the cross. All right, all right. Let's nail it. Okay, ready? Uh, okay. All right. <laughs> Two other men were crucified with him. Alright, okay, that's now one two. There's one over here. Alright. One was on each side of him, and Jesus was in the middle. Pilate had prepared, had a notice prepared, and it was fastened to the cross. It read, Jesus of Nazareth, the King of the Jews. Get it fastened to the side. Right, okay, let's pull it up. Many of the Jews read the sign. What does that say? What does that say? Hey, what does that say? <laughs> the place where Jesus was crucified was near the city. The sign was written in the Aramaic, Latin and Greek languages. The chief priests of the Jews argued with Pilate. They said, do not write the king of the Jews. Write that this man claims to be the king of the Jews. Pilate answered, I have written what I have written. When the soldiers crucified Jesus, they took his clothes. Oh, here we go. Take his clothes. All right. Took his clothes. They divided them into four parts. Each soldier got one part. There we go. Oh, there we go. Jesus' long inner robe was left, and it did not have any seams. It was made out of one piece of cloth from top to bottom. Let's not tear it, they said. No, let's not tear it. No, no let's not tear it. <clears throat> they said to one another, let's cast lots to see who will get it. Roll the dice. Oh, yeah. This happened so that the scripture would come true. It says, they divided up my clothing among them. They cast lots for what I was wearing. So that is what the soldiers did. Jesus' mother stood near his cross. So did his mother's sister Mary, the wife of Clopas, then Mary Magdalene. Jesus saw his mother there. Jesus saw his mother there. He also saw the disciple he loved standing nearby. Jesus said to his mother, Dear woman, here is your son. And he said to the, to the disciple, Here is your mother. And from that time on, the disciple took her into his home. This is a story from the Bible, from John chapter 19, verse 16 to 27. And to find out what happens next, you need to look at part four of the story.